Now, Kenya High School produced beyond the dreams result yesterday, producing six out of the top 15 students nationally in the just concluded KCSE examination. In an exclusive interview with this station, the principal of Kenya High School, Flora Muliatia, has hailed the performance as one of her best in recent years, even though history will judge her fairly as similar results have been posted by a few of the schools she has been the principal. Earlier today, our reporter Saza Munga spent time with the fierce but motherly principal, teachers and students of Kenya High, and filed the following story. Flora Mulatia started her teaching career in 1992, where she was called upon to join a different school after four years in her career. Flora Mulatia is a committed and hardworking teacher who has managed to leave a mark everywhere she goes. Four years into her career, she became the deputy of the Kitise High School in 1996, and in 1997, she was made the principal of the same school where she had 21 students. In 1999, she became the principal of Good Shepherd Girls, where she became the principal. And in 2005, she was called to join Borny Girls and left in 2009, whereby during the 2008 KCSE, she produced the best girl. In 2009, she was called to join Machakos Girls, where she left the school with a mean of 9.2 before joining Kenya High School in 2015. She says her openness with the students is what has enabled her to grow and relate well with others. So I, I relate with my girls as a mother to a uh, uh, daughter so that they can also open up and tell you what is in them and through that you guide them and then they, can, they are free to work, they are able to consult you and they are able to now to open up and you discuss things freely at the same time, you are maintaining discipline. At the same time, you are telling them what to do. But you agree on the path. We usually set targets. We set targets with the teachers beginning of the term. Like now, when you came, you had staff meeting. We agree where are we going. Then we keep on evaluating this target. Are we going up or low? What is affecting us? Why are we not achieving this? If there are girls who are not performing well, what is ailing them? And if it is issue of fees that maybe could be distracting students, I look for people to pay fees for these girls without even informing the girl and without even having anybody. I don't believe in sending students home. So I look for ways to ensure that this girl, for me, I tell them it's a candle in this family. This girl is like a candle. So if you, uh, you put off this candle, then the whole family is done. And it's not our wish. The choice of being born where you are born, it's not your choice. So it shouldn't disadvantage you at any way. The teachers echo her resilience and hard work, which bore fruits in the past and her most recent outstanding performances in the school. Yeah, our chief principal, Mrs. Mulatia, I would say is such a nice, loving lady. Uh, she is somebody who molds her teachers. She stamps her authority on each and every individual. And she also, get, she also knows how to get to the individual teachers. She knows all her teachers by name. And I think that is a, a skill that is very unique in her. And she's so loving. Our chief principal, Mrs. Mulatia, who has always supported and worked hand in hand with every teacher, every department. And occasionally, she calls us for briefs in the office and she gives us some guidance of what we are supposed to do. And once we implement whatever she tells us, then we are able to register those, uh, that great improvement. She has always supported us in terms of materials, anything that you want, the books, any assistance that you want from her to help in the academic. She is such a mother. She's truly a mother. And that's one thing I'll carry to heart. The cultures and the values and the customs that are instilled in us while we are here for these four years are to carry all the way. So I appreciate her for that. Among her many achievements, in 2018, she received an order of Grant Warrior from the president, Uhuru Kenyatta. Being in a male-dominated profession during her career days, Flora Mulatia did not leave it at that. Everywhere she went, she brought change. Reporting for Switch TV, my name is Saza Munga.